I didn't want to farm. I kind of wanted to leave the small town life. We were living in Toronto. We lived downtown. We loved it. Like, we walked everywhere. We biked everywhere. I loved our life in Toronto. I mean, we were setting ourselves up to stay there. My name's Tobin Dick. I farm in southern Manitoba. My wife and I farm with my, with my parents. We're fifth generation farmers here. We grow wheat, soybeans, canola, and this year, black beans as well. Living on a farm or living in the country had never crossed my mind. I would say ever, <laughs> before we decided to come to the farm in 2012. Tobin had gone to the farm for Mother's Day, and I was back in Toronto just hanging out with my friends and working. And I remember I was mowing a lawn. It was a day like today, it was beautiful. Thinking to myself, man, this would be interesting. I, I, could, I could do this. I got a text message from him, and he said, what do you think about moving back to the farm? And I believe my response was, over my dead body. <laughs> then all of a sudden I got another text, and it was just like dot, 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 well, maybe. My parents have always said, if you don't love it, don't do it. There was no pressure from them to take over the farm. That didn't come up in conversations ever. I think what I saw is an opportunity that I wouldn't be able to have unless I'm part of a family farm operation. I do love farming. I do love being outside. I love working with my hands and seeing this all grow and, and learning about the complexities of, of agriculture. Tobin and I spend a lot of time in the winter talking about, okay, what are we going to plant next? What kinds of crops do we want to grow on this farm? We don't need to be just doing the same things over and over again. So we'd like to try new things, like the black beans this year are something that's new. There's something kind of novel about growing a crop that you can just, you know, take straight from the plant and, and cook up and cook up and eat. There are health benefits to eating pulses and Jamie and I try to eat as many beans as we can. We're definitely incorporating more and more of them into our diet. I love to cook beans because I find them filling and tasty and I like to make bean bowls with like beans and vegetables and a dressing and maybe some greens in there. I just like how fast it all comes together. When we lived in the city, we walked everywhere, so it was easy to kind of just be active naturally. And when we moved to the farm, we realized that it had to be more of a conscious effort. We bike around here, we're camping a ton, we're hiking. We try to stay quite, quite active uh, that way. What makes me proud to be a farmer and being able to provide food is that I can, I look out my front window and I see these black beans that we are growing and knowing that people will buy these at the store and that is something that has come from our land. It feels like you're contributing. I just feel this, ah, just peaceful. I just, I, I really enjoy being here in a way that I never thought I would. I enjoy the challenge. I enjoy the fact that I'm not figuring this out anytime soon. I enjoy working with my hands, the learning process, the unpredictability of it. It's the same things that I hate about farming, but also kind of what makes it awesome. It's the color and friction of life that you just, you don't know what tomorrow is going to look like and it could look radically different than today.